just before it happened, I was talking to the man of God that Sunday that I don't know the sex of my child and I required it to be a certain sex for certain reasons. So he told, I asked him, what is God saying or what is the sex? <laughs> the prophet didn't answer me. So I was like, okay. If that's like that, then on Thursday, it was a prophetic service, then he told me that um, as he was prophesying, he sees a boy. And at that time, I thought, no, man, I I want a girl again. So he told me that I had seven days to pray to, in order to receive the girl that I'm praying, that I say I want. So after that, I then decided, no, man, I'm sure this is what God has given me. Let me just settle for that. So two weeks back when I went for a scan, I found out that indeed it is a boy. Yeah. So I like to take my phone. Then two days back, like I had been stressing about finances that um, sort of running behind schedule for the things I wanted to do at a certain time. So um, I was in a conversation with uh, men, on a phone call with men of God, and he said he reminded me of his message on Sunday. He said that uh, remember not to place your 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 faith in men but in God. So I was like, I okay, that given or said. So yesterday I go to this person. I'm like, ah, this is what is being planned, and this is how behind I am. Mind you, this person had told me days before that he doesn't have a certain amount of cash. But just after I told him all these things, he just gave me the amount that I needed or wanted at the time. So I'd like to thank God for that. <laughs> Amen. My sister.